my channel. Today I did this very easy pink champagne eyeshadow look today that you can use for Easter or any other day. Also, remember to give this a thumbs up and also subscribe down below and be my amiga. It's okay if you don't want to be my friends. I don't really have a lot of friends, to be honest. Anyway, y'all need to follow me on my social medias. I hope you like this video. Give this a thumbs up. Subscribe down below if you aren't already. And let's get started. Hey guys, okay, for today's eyeshadow, we are going to be using the Anastasia Beverly Hills in the Sh World Traveler. Oh, um, it's like this. And, um, you yep. To prime my eyes, I'm going to use the NYX Concealer in the shade 04. This is my all time favorite. To a gel. This. You need this. And I'm going to just blend it out with my Real Technique of Beauty sponge. And I'm going to just blend this all out. We're about to hit 90 subs. That's crazy. Okay, this is going to be like a chit chat. Get ready with me. And I'm also going to apply some Air Spongeless Face Powder to set that. So, Easter's coming up, guys. And, huh. I don't know what I'm going to do with my makeup, you know? Sometimes you just want to go unnatural. Sometimes you're just like, should I go dramatic or should I not? Shade um, Soft Peach. And we're just going to put this on our top of our eyebrow bone. Just because, yep. It's going to be Morocco. And this is a very pretty peachy. It's like a peachish brownish color. And this is going to be our transition shade. And we're just going to apply this. Well, this is going to go in our crease and above our crease as well. If you have seen my last video with my collab, if you haven't, go watch. It's going to it's gonna be in the description box below. Like Since Intense Glaze is like a... Intense Glaze is a metallic eyeshadow. I'm going to still apply this on the transition shade as well. Brothers in the background. He could never show up. But yeah, we're going to go back and forth. I'm going to show promotions. And this is going to go where exactly where we just put Morocco. So basically in the crease and our transition shade. And we're going to grab the shade um, Pink Champagne. And this is a very pink champagne color. Oh my god, that is so pretty, dude. Like, my dad would get a mad because I'd be wasting my money on makeup. But, like, oh, I just want to buy a whole Sephora store. I'm going to apply some Kiss Lashes. And these are the number 11. And they look like this. And I'm also going to apply some mascara and I'll be right back. Alright, to prime my face, I'm going to be using a Too Faced Priming Poreless um, Primer from Too Faced. And it looks like, for some reason, my, this just stopped. I don't know why, but I have storage, my camera is all full, battery charge, and all of a sudden my camera wants to stop. How that goes. Oh, I hate when you use primer because then your hand gets a little slippery and then it's hard to open other stuff if you're filming. I feel you too. For foundation, I'm going to be using the L'Oreal um, Infatuable True Match in this shade 108 Caramel Beige. I don't know if this is going to be my color because I was this color when I went to Mexico that summer. And this foundation, I mean, when it's hot, it's hot over there. So, like, this stayed on my face all day like literally all day and i'll be like i'm that type of person to sweat a lot like i usually sweat like right here like on my t-zone basically and this kept on my face and i was just like oh my god i'm, I'm gonna blend this with my real, real technique beauty sponge but yeah it'd be so hot over there and i'm just like dying and then this um this, like, never came off until, like, I took off with, like, makeup wipes. No, I didn't even brought makeup wipes. First of all, I had to take it all by soap. Mm, it's a little, yeah, it's, it's darker than me. 
but it's okay, we're gonna work with her. But, yeah, it was so hot over there. And this foundation didn't come off. And I was just so blessed and thankful for the person who created this foundation. Well, you know, the company. Like, thank you. You saved my life on that trip. If not, I would be looking like a hot mess. As always, I'm gonna be using my NYX HD concealer in the shade 04. And we're gonna concealer and highlight. And that is under our eyes. Look how bright that is. Oh my god. My chin. Cupid bow. News. And forehead. And we're gonna make a little three. Cause we're number three. And we're just gonna blend with my real ticky beauty blender. So I bought my I bought a beauty blender, right? Like my first like a, like a real beauty blender, right? And I used it for like a good five days and then I lost it. I still can't find it. So I'm never gonna buy a beauty blender again. To set my concealer, I'm gonna be using the Airspent Loose Face Powder as always. And I'm gonna blend down there first, like always. Oh shit, wait, wait, blend. You won't look up when you blend. And then do not blink. No, that's it. Cause I don't bake on my channel. Bake on my channel. Bop, bop. I need to buy a cup cause I literally got like. This is just came out of a box and I just cut into this. Life hack guys. For contour, I'm going to be using the Anastasia Contour Kit as always. And I'm going to be using these shades right here. And I'm going to grab this setting brush. Even though it was not so well contour. But hey, we never do. We never actually do what the brushes say. Y'all realize that? Yeah, I, I hope y'all do because we really don't listen. But school's almost over. And I'm really happy. Be a senior for Jesus. <laughs> That's crazy. They really, it really is true when they say high school goes by fast. I, I was a freshman. I was like, oh my god, they're lying. It's gonna take forever. I'm about to graduate. <laughs> That's just crazy. To bronze up my face, I'm be using the Mac and give me some bronzer as always. And I'm gonna use this a dome looking brush from Morphe. I don't have a code, obviously. Hey, don't you just hate when random people call you and you don't even know who they are and they just call you? I'm just like, how do they get my number? Like, just like, stop calling me. I don't have your number saved for a reason, even though I don't know you, stop. Unless you're like somebody, uh, like somebody famous. <coughs> Drink. <coughs> <clears throat> you know, he can hit me up anytime. So with the bake, I'm gonna use this big brush from a Vanity Planet. I have a trouble. I have trouble saying fluffy brush. Fluffy brush. See, I really have trouble. I don't know why. I think it's weird. Like, how do I have trouble saying that? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I think I just cracked. To highlight my face, I'm be using an Anastasia a Glow Kit in that glow. And as always, we're going to be using a, these three shades right here. As always, we're going to go in dripping in gold and bubbly first. And we're going to go where our highest points are. I like my brow bone with Summer. And my inner tear duct as well with Summer. Back to the palette, we're gonna use the same colors and this is gonna go in our lower lash line. Do you hate when your parents are like, like you're old enough to do this and that, but they don't let you do the stuff that you actually wanna do? That's my mom. I swear to God. But my mom's my best friend. Hey mom, I don't know if you're watching this, but I love you. <laughs> She's probably like, oh, I can get them down. She's gonna mad because this is her eyeshadow palette too and she don't use this so I just took it because I'm over savage. For blush, I'm gonna be using the shade Orgasm from NARS. I use this a lot and also the Milani one. Is it Milani, right? I think it is. Those blushes are so nice. 
But yes, I'm gonna just apply this with this Vanity Planet brush and we're just gonna apply this in circular motions like this and just blend the contour and bronzer together. Try this for lips. I'm gonna be using the NYX Lingerie in the shade 12 Exotic. And it looks like this. I think it's gonna be too dark. I don't know. Uh, uh, on top of that, I'm gonna be using the Too Faced Sweet Peach Creamy Peach Oil Lip Gloss in the shade Peach Circle. And this is gonna lighten up the lipstick, I think. I hope it does because it's too dark. Yeah, it does. And to set, to set my face, I'm using a Mar Badesco skincare spray as always. And we're just gonna spray poquito. Hmm. And we're just gonna fan it off with our hands. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you really like this. Remember to give this a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you aren't already. And I hope y'all recreate this look as well. And if you do, DM me. Just DM me. A lot of people don't DM me so I can see it, you know. <laughs> but yeah, thank you for watching. Give this a thumbs up, subscribe down below. And follow all my social medias. They're going to be up here. Yeah, it's up here right now. It's going to be it's, okay. Um, But yeah, thank you for watching. And bye, guys.